The uniqueness of this particular opera is that the choristers really are the dancers in the production. A lot of times productions will hire professional dancers and they'll bring those types of dancers in to fill in the dance roles, but what's really indicative of this production is the choristers are the dancers. And it adds a unique sensibility to taking the audience member into a scene without taking them out by watching a professional ballerina or dancer doing some of these waltzes or polonaise or peasant dances. It's all the choristers and it all adds a unique beauty to staying inside the scene and watching something that's very unique and a very original to the production. Tchaikovsky wrote a lot of dances and you know his music is very powerful and it's very um, nice to kind of get into uh, being able to create movement for the particular phrases, for the particular songs and for the opera itself. So it is a unique challenge to be able to not only sing but also put yourself into a, a dancer mentality where you're actually doing movement on stage. And I think there's a symbiosis there. I think that learning for everybody is one thing and then be able to put it on stage is a very different thing. Mm -hmm and it becomes a nice symbiosis to where it becomes more comfortable and it becomes real and it becomes right in the moment because that's what you know is built for the production to be able to perform and dance and sing. The choreography has been with the opera for a while. I first choreographed on Lyric Opera of Kansas City. That was my first production with Eugene Onegin when this uh, all started. And then it, I was able to go to Detroit and work with the choristers in Detroit. And now I have the extreme pleasure of coming here to Atlanta and working with the choristers here. The baseline of the choreography stays the same. I think that with every different type of chorus, there are different movers and there are different sizes, different types of people. And I think it's really tailoring the movement to the chorus. And so really it kind of it stays true to the original for the most part. And speaking on behalf of you know any type of choreographer that comes into an Atlanta opera, is these choristers are hungry. And it's just really refreshing to see the type of talent that they're bringing uh, to the material. Originally, when I first started working with choristers, I thought that it would be challenging. And eventually, the more and more that I worked with opera singers in, in general is that the professionalism with what they bring their own art form into trying to do something different. And that's the beautiful part of being able to work with uh, choristers because dance is inherent in the body. And everybody, in my opinion, has that dance inside of them.